through this work, we've realized the power of partnerships. And um, we see that you know, no breakfast program is actually successful because of one person. Um, and so you know, to really truly build that sustainable and successful program, you need the support from the entire community as, um, as well as building support within the school. Those of you that are in school districts are, are linked to principals. It is extremely important that you look at every stakeholder and every person that would possibly be involved in the Breakfast in the Classroom program. Um, for my team in particular, I had to start with my administrative team to get their buy-in. I have a team of eight great administrators, and when I brought Breakfast in the Class to them, they said, we're going to feed 1,400 kids. How are we going to do that? And so we just kind of talked about what our kids needed and what were the benefits and, and understanding that, you know, breakfast is the first meal that they receive, and we don't know the last time that they ate breakfast. I presented to my staff um, exactly what I wanted to do for breakfast and of course there are naysayers and their questions and we already have a roach problem, we already have a mouse problem, and we already, all of these different problems that you could imagine and then you have those um, staff that will sit there and watch and, and smile and then maybe frown and then you know the ones that you have to go sit with individually and kind of have conversations with to bring them along but one thing I do know for sure especially about educators no one's going to say that we don't want to feed children. From there we went to students and students desperately want leadership they wanted to be involved with it it was their idea for breakfast ambassadors how could they be involved what could they do um, and as time has gone on they've become more empowered as mr. Diggins said you know they wanted to start taste testing different meals and can we have this and and different opportunities for them to be involved in the program and then parents are extremely excited about it um, at first they didn't really understand you know oftentimes parents just kind of especially at middle school they just kind of let their kids you know just go about their day and they're not really realizing what's going on in their school day and so to know that their child is having breakfast is just one less thing that they have to worry about in addition to lunch. My ask for you is to reach out to your uh, state and local uh, educator union. Uh, we want to partner with you. We would love to work with you. So in closing I just want to say every person, every organization, every local, uh, state and national partners, uh, they all play a piece and all bring something to the table. Everyone brings a piece to the table. So uh, working together as a whole, basically, is much greater than its parts. So if everyone brings together their resources and they share the same mission and the same goal, we all can make a huge impact. So I just want to encourage you and wish you success with your coalition.